Hi guys, Vex here. Welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. And on today's episode, we are going to look for that die maker who's been making uh, the, the punches. We suspect he's involved in this counterfeiting. Or, if he's not involved, maybe he's got uh, some information that would give us a lead. So we'll see which one it is. And I think he's somewhere around here. Maybe in this building? Probably this building. Well, it's not locked. That's a good sign. Maybe upstairs? Hello? Ah, I, I talked to with you. I talked to this guy before about the crown. How goes the work, Master? Getting there, getting there. You need something, my boy? What are you doing here, anyway? You're in an engraver's shop, my boy. We're engraving, of course. Yeah, but engraving what? And what's it used for? Oh, we engrave wood and stone as well as metal. Here in the monastery, it's mostly about decoration. You've got quite a large workshop, Master. You don't do all the work alone, surely? I'm usually here with my apprentice, Florian. Of course, by simple observation, you'll note that this is not currently the case, and I'm here alone. Which means that either I'm a liar or something out of the ordinary has occurred. Um. I see. I think. So what's happened to Florian? He shares the fate of the pharaohs for today. The fifth scourge of Egypt did smite him. The plague. Or so his message advised me. Jesus Christ. The plague? Do remain calm. I'm quite certain the plague from which Florian is suffering wasn't a judgment from on high. Or if it was, it was a judgment on excessive drinking. <laughs> I'm told such an ailment can be of truly biblical proportion. I like this guy. What's he like, your apprentice, Florian? I'm afraid that his exuberant youth has taken its toll. He's been acting strangely of late. I fear he has delusions of persecution. I don't really know what you mm, mean. Guilty conscience? Recently, for example, he told me that someone was following him. And the very next day he bought a padlock from the blacksmith and locked up his chest. As though I would ever sneak into it. In any case, why the interest? Are you looking for him? Something like that. May I ask why? Uh... Huh. He owes me money. Naturally. Dice or boozing, was it? Pray do tell. Uh, both. Sodom and Gomorrah are too good for the boy. Here you go. I'll dock his wages. Thank you, Master. You're most kind. But I'd rather get it from him myself. If you think he'll have anything to give, please yourself. About your question, you'll find him at home, no doubt feverishly dying. He sleeps in the baker's cellar. Ah, thank you. Does Florian have any enemies? A man such as he certainly owes money at every turn, and the parents of local girls are undoubtedly displeased with his attempts to propagate. <laughs> However, most recently it was that fury from the baths who accosted him in quite a spectacular rage. A woman from the baths. What did she do? The harpy nearly tore all Florian's hair out. I don't frequently feel sorry for my ne'er-do-well apprentice, but on that occasion I made an exception. Do you have any idea why she did it? She was screaming about some girl, some flighty bathmaid, Esther. I would say that Florian had felt the joys of spring and acted accordingly, although one would have thought they'd be used to that sort of thing at the bathhouse. <laughs> Thank you. The choice I'll leave you to your work. Uh, 
Oh, bless. I like that dude. Uh... Alright, well, in this case, I guess we should check out the bathhouse, maybe? Oh, I'm, well, I'm definitely gonna check out the bathhouse, you know what I mean? Uh, wait, no! Re! Zoom in! How do I zoom in? Oh, full screen, and then I have to, uh, ugh. Okay, there we go. Alright, uh, so I need, the, the baker's cellar is down here, I think. Um... I guess I'll fast travel here. It is the probably faster, and then go northeast. I really do wish I could abort fast traveling, but whatever. And then let's check out the bathhouse first. And while I'm there, I can refresh my buff. I I didn't actually think that would work. Uh Who is it? What do you want? You no business here. Who's there? Hey. Jesus. It's Jesus, yes. Wow, I got my horse stuck. I'm so glad is Bucephalus trespassing or is he allowed to be back there? Oh, Bucephalus wants that made. Okay. I'll take this one, I guess. I hear you're at odds with Apprentice Florian. At odds? I'll give you at odds. It's that sod's fault they took my Esther. Poor girl. I shudder to think what's become of her. They? What exactly happened? This man came in wanting a bath, and Esther with it. She doesn't normally offer that kind of service, but I didn't see the harm, so I sent her in to him. And suddenly I hear screams. So I run out, and I see the bastard pulling her out of the tent and shoving her into a boat. A boat? I'm sorry they took her, but what exactly has it got to do with Florian? They shouted at me to tell Florian that when he rises up, he'll get the girl back. What exactly happened? This man came in wanting a bath, and Esther with it. Oh, so, oh, I thought she it was Florian at first. No, it was another man. It, and suddenly I hear screams. So I... I'm sorry. They shouted at me to tell Florian that when he rises up, he'll... Okay, so someone abducted... I assume that Florian okay. knows this, Esther. You know, village girls. They don't get much of a choice. Every other knave has a turnip for a brain. And if they don't... Their relatives. And then some young dandy turns up who writes her little poems. What's the poor girl to do? And this is how it ends. She should have stuck with the turnip heads. <laughs> the turnip heads. Where can I find this Florian? I'd like to ask him a few questions. He works in the engraver's workshop at the monastery craftsman's yard. And if he's not there, he'll be holed up like the rat he is in the cellar he rents from the baker. He's afraid of me, for sure. What did the bailiff make of it? Don't even get me started on that. He's another fine... I won't say what. I told him everything, but he says he won't do nothing about it. How's that then? He wouldn't tell me to my face, of course. But people here don't think much of us. There's some as reckon my Esther deserves what she got. Poor girl. It sounds like you were close to Esther. I loved her like my very own. She came to me as an orphan, like a wolf child she was. I raised her and taught her and gave her a job, and now she's gone. Who knows if she's even alive? I'd like to know more about... Oh, wait a minute. H hold on a sec. I'd like to... Uh-huh. I've, uh, heard you have not- I'm sure you'll be- God bless- <gasps> oh. Ankles! Oh. 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 Do you want- Now this one only took two hours. Hmm. Hmm. Something 
happened? Greetings, Henry. You were just with me for two hours. What the hell? What are you doing? So which one did I get this time? Yep. Come now. Come now? I think I already did, lady. Give me a minute. Christ almighty. Give me, like... Can I have 15 minutes? Can I get something to eat? <sighs> what the hell? What are you doing? You're filthy now. You just walked through a bunch of shitty algae and you didn't use this nice bridge. Oh, uh, this game. This is a game. Jesus. Christ be praised. So, do I have any leads to go talk to? No, just go talk to him now. Well, now I can confront him about the uh, the thing with Esther. I have more information. Information. God save you, Henry. God save you, anonymous dude. I don't know why I'm running over here when I could have just come on my horse. Not that way, God. You guys, stop. You should be ashamed. <laughs> Getting stuck on level geometry. What's this? Eyebright. We'll take the eyebright. That's a horse's ass. What's this? It was something. I didn't even notice what it was. Uh, hello? Hellozes! Oh, hey, dude. Good luck. in a cellar. Jeez. You look quite sprightly for an invalid. What? Who the hell are you? My name's Henry, and I'm making inquiries for Sir Radzig Kobola. And what do you want from me? Straight to the point, then. All right. I've been investigating counterfeit money, and the trail led me straight to you. Does the name Rapporteur mean anything to you? Um, I, I don't know. Uh, maybe? Don't bother. I know you know him. You make the punch dies for the counterfeiters. How do you hand them over? Do you know where their workshop is? I can't say anything. I'll deny everything and you've got nothing on me. No evidence, just accusations. It's got something to do with that girl, hasn't it? How do you know? That doesn't matter. No, I, I suppose not. I didn't want to get involved, I swear. Those bastards kidnapped Esther. If I don't cooperate, they'll kill her. I think that kind of maybe does justify his actions if 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 my if my nugget was captured I would I mean like it's um duress is the is the legal term for it acting under du under duress. So, yeah, I mean if he's I mean the bailiff already said he wouldn't do anything about it. So, what's this guy to do? I actually I I do feel sorry, sorry for about him. That. Me too. Listen, I'll tell you everything, I promise. But only if I know that Esther's safe. What, so I'm to go searching for her in the woods? I know where they're keeping her, but nobody will help me. And what can puny little me do faced with those strapping great villains? I'm gonna go save this girl. Very well. I'll bring back your Esther. Really? Yes, but then you have to tell me everything. I will. I swear to God Almighty. Please, just bring her back to me. Nothing else matters. Where are they keeping her? In the Scallet's Hills. There are some abandoned cottages around the mines. That's where I saw her last. They took me there when I said they had to let me speak to her. All right. I'll go there and try and think of something. You're my saviour. I'm Don't going to ride over there and then kill all of them and then save the girl and then maybe there will be ankles in my future. All right, all right. Uh nah, I have I have I have my waifu already. I've got Teresa. I don't need any other ankles. Except for that Teresa just, like, never talks to me anymore. So what's the fastest way to... Uh, 
Um, looks like maybe actually goes south from Scallets. This could be a while. Oh, I love that the bathhouse tops up my health, energy, and food. That's that's amazing. That it just tops off everything. That's really convenient. I'm never I'm never sleeping in a normal bed again if I can help it. Oh, I'm riding through the woods at, in nighttime. I hope I don't get any random encounters. I just kind of want to get to my quest objective and, you know. Later. <laughs> Later. Fuck. What do you want? Get out of here before something happens to you. Okay, well, that was easy, I suppose. Oh, hey! Hey, hey, check it out! It, uh... It stopped my fast travel for me, actually. Fairly close to where I needed to go. Well, alright then. I suppose that wasn't so bad. Thanks, Brandon Encounter Bandits. You're still buttholes, though. What's this? Someone there? Hello! Who are you guys? Well, I never. The pig turns hey, up willingly to the slaughter. Come here. Oh shit! Raise the alarm. Over here. Where is everyone? Quick! Uh. What the hell is this? Wait, is this the... No, this is not. This is... some... something else. <laughs> is that the best you can do? I mean, not really. That was a pretty bad shot. I don't know who these guys are. They just attacked me. Well, that guy's got an arrow in his gut. Can't see shit, Captain. Let's just go this way and hope for the best. Ow! Oh, fuck! That hurt me. I am badly hurt from that. Well, at least I've got open ground now. Are they still after me? I'm still in combat. They're still after me. Holy shit. Oh, there we go. <sighs> okay. Uh, hopefully there's a bed around here. Can I harvest this? What is this? Is this useful? No. I think there's a bed in here. There's a villager. Hey, can I use your bed? Oh, that's the dude that uh, wanted me to look for the priest, right? Let's try this one. Can't see shit, Captain. Oh my god, I can't see anything. Uh, torch. Damn it. I just need to sleep through the night and also heal up. I know there's a bed around here somewhere. Because I've used it before. Uh, maybe up here? Probably. What's this? We'll gather dandelion. I think there's one over here, maybe? This is the preacher, uh, the priest's house that I hired. Hey! Yeah, you! 
This guy has just literally been standing here the entire time, staring hey. at his house. For reals. That's a... Ah, maybe here. Yes! We'll rest here until dawn. Oh. Guess I'll rest here and get as much HP back as I can. I'm just glad it didn't hurt my horse. I mean, it probably did. It probably took HP off my horse, too. Oh, man. I hate... I hate tight pathways at nighttime. It's such a horrible place to try to do any kind of mounted combat. Uh, well, ah, that's better. We can actually see now. I don't need my torch anymore. I almost wish there was a hot key just for torches. I like to pull out the torch and, and put it away. You know? And I wouldn't actually need to de-equip my shield. Like, I would still have my... Like, I wouldn't be getting any benefit from my shield, but it would still be equipped, and I wouldn't have to constantly swap between them. You know what? You guys know what I mean, right? Uh, okay. Let's go... Uh, I guess that's enough HP, right, guys? Let's go find some bandits. do we want to pop off here? Maybe those? <laughs> Had a seven days flashback and I wanted to loot that tree stump. I guess this terrain's okay for horse uh, horse archery. It's certainly not as bad as the uh, the other one. How close are we getting? Pretty close to the territory. Uh, we can pick up the pace. <clears throat> so. A ru uh, ruined cottage, they said? There it is. Alright then. Do I want to even talk with them? Should I poison my long distance arrow? Nah, I don't think I, I don't think I need to poison anything. I have some dried mushrooms though. Oh, that's gonna cure way more than light wounds. That would heal quite a lot, I think. Place at the wrong time. 
Two arms! Get over here! Oh, yeah. How long did it take me to get out my friggin' bow and and knock an arrow? For Over fuck's here. sake, Henry. Where is everyone? Quick! D he's just dead. I hit him! Two arms! Get over here! Oh, I think he saw me. Over here! Where is everyone? Quick! That was easy. Key to a shed. I'll take the most more valuable bits, I suppose. Last guy ran off to. There he is. Hey, buddy. Damn it. Hold on, just stand still. I'll get you. Hey, all of you, gather here. Raise the alarm. Raise There's... the alarm. Watch out. Two arms! Get over here! And stay out. I'm trespassing. I'm still going to pick this lock just because I want the XP. I'll do anything. Just please take me away from here. Anything? Oh, no. Don't be like that. Be nice. They won't hurt you now. However did you find me? Florian told me where they took you. I'm a fool. I thought he was just a dandy, God knows why. And it turns out he's a villain in league with thieves. And a coward, too. This whole time, he knew where I was. <laughs> Jesus! I almost want to say this just because I want to see what happens. I want to say I want to pick this option just because it's interesting, even though I normally wouldn't do that. I can't resist. For the love of Christ, will you be quiet? You should be glad you're still alive. Oh, you're not the savior I imagined. Yeah, well, life's full of disappointments. We should probably set off. I'll go with you. I'd hate to lose you on the way. <laughs> I just thought to shut up. Oh my god. Sorry, Florian. I was going to try to help you out and say it wasn't your fault, but the game gave me a dialogue option that was too interesting to pass up. Burger.
Is there something you need? Hey, buddy. I got your woman back. Though I don't know if My she's humble gonna think of herself that way. How may I serve you? I found that Esther of yours. I know! Back already. How can I ever thank you? By telling me all about the goings-on with Rapita. They found me in the tavern one evening. Caught me when I went to the ship pile. They started to badger me about working for them. They? Yes. Rapita. And a knight they called Sir Yezek. And then what? They explained what they wanted from me and I told them to sod off. I'm guessing that didn't go down too well. It wasn't all that bad. They just threw me on the dung heap and left. I thought it was just a drunkard's joke. But then they took Esther. Where will I find Rapita? He's usually wherever I am. What does that mean? He watches me. Everywhere I go. And when I'm at home, he sits on the bench in the square, watching my house. So he's there now? Hard to say. Sometimes I see him in the tavern on the green, buying supplies. All right. At least I know where to start. And you go to work tomorrow, you hear? Why? Because we have to lure him out. And besides, your master will surely be glad to see you. I have my doubts. Why didn't you tell anyone? At first, I took it for a bad joke. And then, when they snatched Esther, there was nothing to be done. I suppose I'd better go. I'd hate the bastard to get away. Good luck, and thanks for the help. Here we are. I am at your service, Sir Knight. I'm gonna buy some beer. This is making me hungry. That salami looks pretty good too. Maybe a pretzel? Uh, can I sell you anything? Not really, no. Okay, um, so next up is... Gonna be next episode, actually. Um, well that was pretty productive. Things went fairly smoothly. It's nice for a change, huh? Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, take it easy.